the scariest thing about epilepsy is you never know when it is going to strike. One minute your child is fine and the next minute you're wheeling your son into the ICU and you absolutely don't know what's going to happen next. Epilepsy did not just shatter my son, teaches his life. It shattered my entire family's life. His brain took such a beating. He's not able to speak. He's not able to walk properly. As a mother, I felt powerless. And I realized that I've got to do something. I could not let doctors alone decide the fate of my son's life. I researched epilepsy obsessively for about three and a half years. I wanted to create a device that could predict an epileptic attack before it happens. That's where the idea of this glove came from. The sensors inside the glove can sense the different vitals from the body and send it to the Edison module. We chose Edison because it's powerful and can process the data immediately, streaming it wirelessly to patients and caregivers anywhere and possibly save somebody's life. I wish I could have invented this before Tejas went through what he did. But I created this because of him. What wouldn't a mother do to save her son? I became a researcher, a scientist, and also a maker, because that's what he needed me to become. Epilepsy did not just shatter my son, teaches his life. It shattered my entire family's life. His brain took such a beating. He's not able to speak. He's not able to walk properly. 